was Allah the one that made them believe that Jesus was the one that was crucified? Allah okay. made them seem it was someone that is not. Okay. If that... I made something that seem that is not, it's deceiving somebody else. When the Quran mentions the fact that um, Jesus was not crucified, yes, or no killed, yeah, it was made to look like he was. That Allah protected him. Yes, it was made to look like he was. So okay. I would like to say, okay, right, that firstly, mm -hmm. you have no idea who was replaced. I don't. And why they were replaced? Because Jesus was protected. Yes. Because Jesus was protected. Okay. Right. And who was the person that made them see that Jesus? It was Jesus. Because bear in mind. Ironically enough, before Islam, mm -hmm. Christianity reigned for 600 years. And reigned? then, not when we reigned, but it was, was known for them to okay. believe that it was Jesus Christ. Okay. And after 600 years, then Islam. Were there, Islam okay, so, so were Muhammad there Christians that didn't believe in the Nicene Creed? I don't know what's well, you got to read up your stuff then, Kenneth, before you come. <laughs> you got to get your big boy pants I on. Him, I, I got no, you. No, I know, I know. What I'm saying is. If you think Christianity was... Wait, I'm oh, okay. I'm What's that your question? <laughs> was Allah the one that made them believe that Jesus was the one that was crucified? That's your question. I want to understand, because it was made to look like... What's your was. question? The, the Quran was mentioned, it was made known to them. No, no, no. That, that, that's not what the Quran says. Can you want to bring can, can, can can we, we bring a Quran? Yeah. Yeah. I would love to see the verse. Sure, let's do it. There's the Quran here. Do you, do you, do you, know, the, do you know the verse? Yeah, you know the verse, you're quoting yeah, but you, it. You also quote it as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, so you have uh, no it, so you know the verse. I do know the verse. I don't know exactly where it comes from. Okay, so. so but I know it was a deal with no crucified or no killed. What's your question? If Can you hold this real quick? Allah yes. made it known to them okay. right, that he was not crucified, okay. it was someone that looked like him, okay. right? Yeah. yeah. If it was made to look like him, it means the Jew. It means that Allah okay. made them seem it was someone that is not. Okay. If that... I made something that seem that is not, is deceiving somebody else. Good. Let's look at the verse, right? Okay. Go ahead. And because of their saying in boast, we killed Messiah, Isa, the son of Mary, the messenger of Allah. But they killed him not, nor crucified him. But it appeared to them in resemblance was put over another man and they yeah. killed him. And those who differ upon are full of doubts. Okay. okay. So it does okay. not say that Allah made it to look like I, them. Where is it, sir? I'm sorry, go ahead, right here. Where is it, where is it, please? Right here. I'm going to say in both, we killed him in so they mentioned Allah. But they killed him not, but it appeared, so it appeared to them. Yeah, Allah didn't make the person look like that. That's what appeared to them. For example, if you come to arrest me, and because of your Islamophobia, you might arrest my brother and he appears to you that it's me. Okay? It doesn't mean that Allah fooled them or tricked them. That's not what the verse says. Okay? It appeared to them. They came to get Jesus. They got the wrong man. They did not kill Jesus. Okay? And so all of this leads us to the topic of a man by the name Barabbas. Barabbas is mentioned in all four Gospels, Matthew 27, Mark 15, Luke 23, and John 18. Uh, we are told in the scripture that Barabbas, who appears just at this time, just at the time that Christ is getting ready to be judged by Pilate and the people, of course, the mobs of people, who are standing there calling for his crucifixion. But one other area that is interesting about Barabbas and that is just not really talked about very often is the fact that he also had a first name. And his first name appears in several different translations of the Bible. You'll find his first name in these accounts as Jesus in a new international version, like the NIV. If you have the Net Bible, and there are many other Bibles that translate not only Barabbas, his last name, but also his first name. His first name appears uh, in the ancient texts. In fact, when we take a look at Barabbas, we see in the 1906 Jewish Encyclopedia, here's what it says. Origen, who was one of the early church fathers, reports that in several manuscripts of the gospel, he had seen the name given as Jesus Barabbas, or Jesus, son of Abba. 
Accordingly, the first name was afterwards omitted from the manuscripts of the Gospels when the name of Jesus had become sacred. Look at his name. What does Bar Abbas mean? Uh, Bar Abbas. And it is son of father, right? Bar, if I say Simon Bar Jonah, then that would be Simon, the son of Jonah, right? In Islam, it's bin, uh, but here it's Bar, Bar Abbas. Who is this Barabbas, the son of? Barabbas is the son of father, Abba, right? And we know that word to be father. Jesus, son of Abba. Strange name for this in individual to have and such a strange occurrence that's happening here. So early on, apparently, and you can read about this in history, that there was some concern about Jesus Barabbas and Jesus Christ. And in fact, there are some even who claim that Barabbas was the one who was killed and that Jesus was set free because of the confusion. Which one is he talking about? It's a very important discovery that exists in the Bible. Because Pilate wants to get rid of Jesus, and he, he tries to get the crowd to take Jesus, but they say, no, we don't want Jesus, we want Barabbas. Pilate, according to these accounts, had this custom of releasing a prisoner during the Passover to appease the crowd. We don't know, by the way, historically of any such practiced by Pilate or by any other Roman governor of any place else in the entire world at the time or any other time. But that's the story is predicated on that he wants to release somebody and he wants to release Jesus. Uh, first of all, we have no record of this anywhere else, uh, not just of not releasing a prisoner, but specifically, we don't have any record of anybody named Barabbas that was involved in this, apart from these gospel accounts. And why that's interesting is because the name Barabbas maybe a made-up figure. Bar in Aramaic means son, and Abba means father. He's the son of the father. Which son of God do you want? Do you want the peaceful son of God who's willing to give his life for you? Or do you want the insurrectionist that's going to have lead to the destruction of the nation? Oh yeah, we want the insurrectionist. The, the Roman governor would let free somebody who was in, you know, fomenting rebellion against Rome. What they did with those people is they crucified them and they left them on crosses for a few days so their body deteriorated and got attacked by scavengers. That's what they did to people like that. They didn't let them go. What? Oh. Cool. 